Hello and welcome to Enjoy English. I'm Stevie, and I'm Hetty. Now today we're looking at our on-air English lesson, and we're talking about booking a flight. We're going to look at a dialogue here between two people, and this is something, especially this time of the year, where we have the Lunar New Year or Chinese New Year coming up.、Uh, a lot of people are booking flights to either maybe. Go home or to go travel somewhere.、Uh, like for me, I I go home back to the U.S. for Christmas to see my family. So I have to book a flight. And if you want to travel overseas, or if you are overseas and you know you want to travel or go home, this is something. This type of English is something we can all use. Learning how to book a flight in English. 嗯，所以，我们今天要学很实用的英文是怎么样教你订机票。其实现在这个时候呢，其实农历新年已经要到了。Yeah. 那很多人呢会在这个时候想要订机票回家啦。不过现在订机票出去玩可能有点太晚。那这个故事其实它很特别，是他在跟他的一个所谓的旅行社的人员来订。这个机票， yeah. 然后去讲说我们要怎么样换地点啦，怎么样时间啦，去怎么样去瞧这些东西，这些英文怎么讲？今天我们会教大家订机票很实用的英文。The dialogue, 情境对话。Most of the package trips to Bangkok I just mentioned are about the same price. Sadly, I can't afford any of them. Could you check on Hong Kong for me? I can crash at my cousin's place there. Sure. When would you like to fly out? I'd like to leave at the end of the month, if possible. Is there any particular airline you would care to use? It doesn't matter. Whichever one is the cheapest will do. All right. I'll check the system and get back to you this afternoon. Thanks. I appreciate you doing this for me. No problem. I'm just glad I could help. The explanation, 内文讲解 Okay, we start out with Wayne. Now Wayne is trying to arrange a trip with his travel agent friend Irene over the phone.、Uh, so he's trying to arrange. Well, when we say arrange, when you arrange something, you're trying to schedule something or trying to get something scheduled. And when we arrange a trip, then we basically want to get tickets.、Uh, maybe we need a hotel. Maybe we need a rental car. Maybe they're arranging a whole trip, like where you will go when you get there. Are we going to go see the Tiger Zoo, like in Thailand, or if we're going to New York?、Uh, does you know? I want my trip to include tickets to see、uh, the Metropolitan Opera. Or maybe the Statue of Liberty, or you know things like this. So he's arranging a trip with his travel agent friend, and her name is Irene. He's doing it over the phone. We can say over the phone or on the phone. We call it over because it's over the phone lines. So over or on, either one is okay. Hmm. So we say we're just talking about this. The two main characters. One is Wayne. 他这个人他怎样？他是 trying to arrange a trip. 呃、uh, ，arrange 这个字，它是一个动作，它是指安排的意思。它安排一个 a trip， 它安排一个所谓的旅游的一个行程。它跟谁在安排呢 ？With his travel agent friend， 他在跟他旅行社的朋友。呃、uh, ，travel agent 是一个旅行社工作的人员。我们讲旅行社是讲 travel agency，、mm -hmm. 是讲旅行社。所以 travel agent 就是在旅行社工作的人员呢。他怎么样呢？这个 Irene。他跟他在讨论这个所谓我们要订机票的一些事情。Yeah. Over the phone, over the phone, 或是 on the phone 都是讲电话。他们在电话里面讨论这样的东西。Now, arrange is our first word today, our first vocabulary word in our words and phrases. And basically, how do you say arrange? 安排
Anpai, yeah, easy word to remember, arrange. Uh, you can arrange trips, you can arrange to have dinner with a friend, or in this sentence, I arranged a photo shoot for all the members of my family. So basically, I arranged a family photo shoot or a family photo session. 嗯，所以说其实全家人都要安排出一个时间来是有点困难。所以这个人呢，我们例句讲说，我来安排我们全家人一起照相。所以这个相片叫做全家福。Uh, now in this conversation, we are talking about uh, with a travel agent. So that would be with a travel agency. Now you could easily, of course, some people prefer to call the airlines directly. They like to order their tickets directly from the airlines. So this kind of conversation is something you could do with either a travel agency or maybe even directly with the airline. 嗯，所以说 airline 就所谓的航空公司，你可以直接跟航空公司做一些联系， yeah. 或者是你也可以跟所谓的 travel agent， 就是这个所谓的旅行社的人员来订一些机票。Uh, so we start out with Irene saying most of the package trips to Bangkok I just mentioned are about the same price. So obviously, in a in a conversation they had earlier that we didn't hear or see. Uh, she was talking about trips to Bangkok, which is in Thailand. So she says to Wayne, "Most of the package trips, a package trip, is a trip that includes your air, you know, your traveling, your airfare, and most likely a hotel and maybe places you want to go to." Okay, so it could be a group tour. It's a package tour. And she said most of the package trips to Bangkok that I just mentioned, that I just talked about, or that I just told you, are about the same price. They all cost about the same. 嗯，所以 Irene 先讲话，她说 most of the package trip， 说、so、package 它是一个包裹的意思。那、mm -hmm. 在这边我们讲 package trip 是指的是一个套装行程，它可能包括很多， yeah. 就像你就是出去玩的时候，可能会包括你的食宿啦， mm -hmm. 还有包括你去的景点游玩啦，全部都帮你安排好，就是所谓的 package trip。那这个呢 ，to Bangkok， Bangkok 是指曼谷。他在泰国去曼谷的这个行程呢 ，I just mentioned 我刚刚跟你提到的 ，mention 是提到的、谈到的这些东西、yeah. ，about the same price， 就是我刚刚提到那些东西，其实去曼谷的套装行程差不多都是这个相同的价钱。Yeah. Now mention is another word in our words and phrases. Um, for instance, the example sentence: Will the reporter mention our names in her article? 嗯，所以说 mention 就是提到、谈到，所以说这位记者会在他的文章里面提到我们的名字吗？ Um, I I'm not sure about that. Did we have a reporter ask us about enjoy English? No. Oh, okay. It's just an example. Sorry. Um, I know. 有时很冷。Right. Yeah, that's just me. It's okay. Uh, so Wayne says, she says. You know they're all about the same price. Wayne says, "Sadly, I can't afford any of them. I'm sad to say that I don't have enough money for any of these trips. I can't afford any of them." Hmm. So, so sadly is very how very sad. He's saying, "But what? How? 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 Wayne, if you can't afford a trip to Bangkok, save money for a little bit longer. Yeah, 如果其实曼谷其实不会很贵啊。如果付不起的话，不如就是你知道，就是再等等。Yeah, 再再存久一点后就可以了哈。嗯。Um, but he says, could you check on Hong Kong for me? So Bangkok is a little too expensive. Could you check on a trip to Hong Kong for me? See what package trips they have. 嗯，所以说，既然说我付不起到曼谷的钱呢 ，Could you check on？ 你可不可以帮我查一下 Hong Kong for me？ 你可不可以帮我查一下那香港的行程是怎么样呢 ？Now I'm going to go back now.、Uh, I almost forgot to talk about afford. You know, I can't afford to not talk about this word. Okay. Now afford sometimes means 付得起 or 买得起 right? 
But sometimes we say, "Oh, I can't afford to forget about something.、Mm -hmm. I can't afford not to do something." And this means I have to do it.、Mm. Yeah. So in this case, our sample sentence: the part-time worker couldn't afford a new car. On his salary. 嗯，所以说我们这边讲说 afford 是指付得起钱，买得起什么？我们通常会用助动词 can 或是 can't 来一起用。Yeah. 所以我们这个例句讲说 part-time worker 就指一个兼职人员，他的薪水呢 couldn't afford a new car on his salary。所以说他的薪水买不起一辆新车。Yeah. So and Wayne says he couldn't afford to go to Bangkok. He wants to check out Hong Kong. Why? He says, "I can crash at my cousin's place there." Now, crash, okay? Crash is usually two cars, like you know, crashing into each other. Well, when he says, you know, check out Hong Kong prices, I can crash at my cousin's place there. There in Hong Kong, he has a cousin in Hong Kong. When you crash at somebody's place, it means you go and you stay there. Now it could mean staying the night. It could mean staying a week. So I'm crashing at my cousin's next week while I'm in Hong Kong. 嗯，所以说我们讲说 I can crash at my cousin's place there. 所以说到香港的话呢 ，I can crash. Crash 这边指的不是冲撞的意思， yeah, no. 而是说它是指过夜。那它时间可能不止一个晚上，它没有单指一个晚上，它可能是一个礼拜啊，或者两三天呐、啊、这样的一个时间。他说，如果你订到香港的话呢，我可以在我的堂哥或是堂兄弟姐妹之类的地方，因为他讲 cousin， 他并没有讲表兄弟姐妹，对，或者是表兄弟姐妹， one, 对，对，就他的亲戚家里面过夜这样子。Yeah,、uh, crash is one of our words and phrases today. Like Sandy crashed in her classmate's dorm room last weekend, so maybe Sandy had tests. She didn't want to go all the way back home, so she crashed in her classmate's dorm room.、Mm. Or maybe they just went out and had fun all weekend. Okay, so it's a dorm. It's just a dorm. Yeah, he's just a dorm. So it's a Sandy. He's in his classmate's dorm room last weekend. 上个周末 last weekend， 他上周末在他同学的宿舍房间里面过夜的。So,、uh, moving back, Irene says, "Sure, sure," meaning,、uh, "Yeah, I can help you look up prices for Hong Kong." When would you like to fly out? When would you like to leave? To fly out of a place means to leave, to fly and leave, fly out. 嗯，所以说 sure 就代表说 Irene 刚刚讲说当然 OK 啊，我可以帮你查这样的行程。所以 when would you like to fly out？ 所以 when 你什么时候想要搭飞机离开？我们讲 fly out 就是真的是就是搭飞机离开、mm -hmm. ，fly out、yep.。嗯，搭飞机离开的意思。And fly out is also one of our words and phrases. It's a phrase we have today.、Uh, our original plan. This is the sample sentence. Our original plan was to fly out on Friday. But something came up, and we didn't. So we hope it was a typhoon that came up, because usually, if something comes up and you don't fly out, you have to pay a lot of money to change the ticket. 嗯，很麻烦。如果说，其实我们常常会就是出国或怎么样，大家可能都遇过，就是临时你的航班可能被取消，或是可能被 delay， 那就会很麻烦。所以通常都是一些天灾才会造成。那我们这个例句就讲说。Yeah. Our original plan, 我们原先的计划怎样的 ？To fly out on Friday, 我们礼拜五的时候呢，要搭飞机离开。Mm -hmm. But something came up. 但是某件事情发生了 ，and we didn't. 所以我们就后来就没有办法搭飞机离开。Yeah. So, and he says, "Well, I'd like to leave at the end of the month, if possible." So at the end of the month. You notice he doesn't say at the end of next month. He doesn't say at the end of January. He said the end of the month. So he means this month. Okay, I'd like to leave at the end of this month, if possible. Now, if possible is one of our tips in use,、uh, and we'll be looking at that toward the end of the article.、Uh, but it basically means, you know. If that is possible, if if I can do that, or if there is a flight, or if I have enough money, there's a lot of ifs that it could mean. But 
If possible, I'd like to leave at the end of the month. 嗯，他说，所以呢，我想要什么时候离开 ？I like to leave at the end of the month. 所以说 ，at the end of the month， 他没有指定哪一个月。The month 就等于是 this month， 就是这一个月。Yeah. 所以我希望在 the end of 这个月过到最后面，就是指这个月的月底。If possible， 如果可以的话。Irene says, "Is there any particular airline you would care to use?" Uh, now, this word particular. This means like、um, if you are particular about something, then you are picky about it. But if you want something particular, you want maybe a a special one. You want you know you're very particular about something, so you want something that is basically you want what you want. Does that make sense? Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, 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 Uh, for instance, we might you hear this a lot.、Uh, living in Taiwan, and you know, when I go back to the U.S., I always have friends who say, "Oh, can you bring me something? Can you bring this back?" And、uh, if I'm really in a good mood, I'm always in a good mood. But usually, I don't offer to bring things back because I get too many people wanting too many things. Uh, but if I'm in a good mood, I might say, "Is there a particular item, or is there something special? Is there a particular item you want me to bring back, bring back to Taiwan from the U.S.?" Yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I wasn't asking. So, 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 Particular item 就是特别什么样的东西。Yeah. Item 指的是一些事情、东西、事物。You want me to bring back? 你想要我带回来？从哪里带回来呢 ？From the U.S. 从美国带回来。Yeah. Now back to the article. Irene says it doesn't matter. Now this means actually 都可以。嗯 ，Right. <laughs> 都 OK， 都没有问题。Yeah. Uh, it doesn't matter, and we're going to see that also in our tips and use box at the end of the article.、Uh, but he says it doesn't matter whichever one is the cheapest will do. So we could also say whatever is the cheapest. But here he's specifying whichever one is the cheapest will do. I can accept the cheapest. Just let me know what the cheapest is. Hmm. 看来 William 真的没有什么钱，所以他说没有关系。但是 whichever one is the cheapest will do. 所以不管哪一家，只要是最便宜的那一家就 OK 了。Okay. So now Irene says, "All right." In other words, okay, I'll do that. I'll check the system and get back to you this afternoon. To get back to somebody means that. You have an answer to give them, or they're waiting for something from you. So you know, sometimes somebody calls you, "Hey, I'm busy right now. I'll get back to you later. I'll call you back later, or I'll contact you somehow later." Okay, so he said, "All right." He said, "Okay, I know." So I'll check the system. I will 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 check the system. 今天的下午呢，我会怎么样 ？Get back to you。刚刚 Stevie 有解释说，什么叫 get back to you， 就代表回复你， yep. 不管是从电话也好，从 email 也好 ，get back to you 就代表说我回复你这个动作。Yeah， and Wayne says thanks， thank you， I appreciate you doing this for me。Now appreciate just means to be thankful for something， so thank you， I'm thankful that you are doing this for me。He's just being very polite. You know, she's a friend. She's helping him. I appreciate you doing this for me. 嗯，所以说他就很有礼貌的回答，他说 ，Thanks， 很感谢你。I appreciate， appreciate 的就是感激的意思。Mm-hmm. 所以 I'm thankful for 也是可以。他说 ，I appreciate you doing this for me。他说我很感激你为我做了这些的这么多的事情。And appreciate is one of our words and phrases today. Again, it means thankful. Uh, 
This is something that you might hear if a friend has come very far to help you. I really appreciate you coming all this way to help me. So maybe they came from Kaohsiung to Taipei just to help you. Hmm. So you say, I really appreciate. 我真的很感谢怎么样 You coming all this way to help me. All this way 代表大老远 Yeah, it means it's far. 对，很远的一个一个距离 All this way to help me. 你大老远过来帮我的忙，我很感激 Now, Wayne just said thank you. I appreciate you doing this for me. Thank you so much. And Irene says. No problem, no problem. 不要客气 Yeah, I'm just glad I could help. I'm just happy I could help a friend. 嗯，所以说 Irene 就直接回答他说，哦，就是 no problem， 就是不用客气啦。I'm just, I'm just glad that I could help. 就说我只是很高兴说我可以帮得上忙。Yeah, we're good friends. I want to help you. And when you buy a ticket from me, I make money. Right. <laughs> <laughs> That's all the time we have for today. But we'll see you back here next time for more enjoy English. And、uh, do want to say to you not to forget our tips in use.、Uh, we had if possible and it doesn't matter for our tips in use. So don't forget those. And also,、uh, I want to say happy Chinese New Year. Okay, so we're today to talk about two things. Two tips and use. Don't forget. One is if possible. One is it doesn't matter. Then, tips and use. Small unit. After watching, have a happy New Year. Happy Chinese 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 New Year. 今天我们要来看的第一个是，如果可能的话，要怎么说？在本文中 ，I'd like to leave at the end of the month if possible。当中的 if possible 就是 if it is possible 的省略，它可以放在主要子句的之前或者是之后。我们可以看一下下面的例句 ：If possible, can you give me a discount on the cost of the repairs? 如果可能的话，您可以给我的修缮费用打点折扣吗？也可以这样用。We want to get home by nine o'clock, if possible. 可能的话，我想要在九点前回到家。而另外 ，if necessary 则表示有必要的话。其实用法和 is possible 相同。例如 ，I can help you with your report if necessary. 如果需要的话，我可以帮忙您写报告。接下来我们要来看的是 matter 的用法。在本文中 ，it doesn't matter 当中的 matter 它是当做动词，表示要紧、重要或者是有关系。例如一个对话 ：We missed the bus. It doesn't matter. Another one is coming in five minutes. 我们错过公车了，没关系。下一班公车五分钟后就来了，或者也可以这样用 ：It doesn't matter where we live as long as we are together。意思就是说，住哪儿都不要紧，只要我们在一起就好。而另一方面 ，matter 其实也可以当做名词，它表示问题。而相关的片语 ，It's a matter of blah blah blah， 表示是什么什么的问题。暗指某件事情迟早会发生。例如，我们看下面的例句 ：It's just a matter of time before we make it big。我们飞黄腾达只是时间的问题而已。好的，相信大家都已经学会了 if possible 跟 matter 的用法了。我们下次见喽，拜拜。Words and phrases， 单字片语。One arrange. I arranged a photo shoot for all the members of my family. Two, mention. Will the reporter mention our names in her article? Three, afford. The part-time worker couldn't afford a new car on his salary. Four, crash. Sandy crashed in her classmate's dorm room last weekend. Five, fly out. 
Our original plan was to fly out on Friday, but something came up and we didn't. Six particular. Is there a particular item you want me to bring back from the U.S.? Seven appreciate. I really appreciate you coming all this way to help me. The dialogue, 情境对话 Most of the package trips to Bangkok I just mentioned are about the same price. Sadly, I can't afford any of them. Could you check on Hong Kong for me? I can crash at my cousin's place there. Sure. When would you like to fly out? I'd like to leave at the end of the month, if possible. Is there any particular airline you would care to use? It doesn't matter. Whichever one is the cheapest will do. All right. I'll check the system and get back to you this afternoon. Thanks. I appreciate you doing this for me. No problem. I'm just glad I could help. Just for fun, 趣味英文 Booking a flight used to mean going to a travel agent, but these days studies have shown that most people actually book their flights online. This is due to a number of factors. First of all, booking online is often cheaper. There are lots of websites offering cheap flights to destinations all over the world. A study done in the UK revealed another reason. It seems that the British don't trust travel agents as much as they used to, so they actually feel safer booking their own flight online than they do having someone else do it for them. If you want to get the cheapest flights, keep a couple of tips in mind. First of all, check for cheaper prices the morning after you book your ticket. If the price fell, cancel the ticket and book again. There's no penalty if you cancel within 24 hours. Also, take last-minute trips if you can. Prices drop when airlines can't fill up their airplanes. <laughs> 